Hey, it's Zana. Welcome back to Solar Trip Podcast. And if you're new here, hi, I'm an independent music artist. I write, record and produce my own music. And I also film four series here on my YouTube. And this one is all about spirituality and metaphysics and the occult and so, so much more. I am back. <laughs> it has been six months since I have filmed any kind of chit chat sit down video and it's so so weird to be on camera but it feels so good to finally be back I'm sorry I disappeared for so long I never even imagined that that would happen that wasn't a plan like it's not something that I decided to do it just kind of ended up being that way so I figured for this podcast we will sit down and let's just catch up on everything that has been going on and the revelations that I've had but also please know I have worn the worst possible top for this I should have tried it on when I bought it because it does not fit properly and it just keeps falling and unzipping for no reason without me even doing anything and it's very annoying so I may have to pause this video a few times just to pull the zip back up and then once I finish filming I'm gonna get changed <laughs> into some pajamas because this is just too much for my liking but anyway so where have I been what have I been doing oh my god so yeah <laughs> I've said in my um whatsapp messages to some of you guys that I was like going through some personal family situations so I needed to take a break from social media but that just kept on going and going on and on for such a long time and so I just wasn't in the mood already emotionally and mentally to get on camera and start talking about life when I was going through my own life problems so I needed to just switch off from everything I stopped even making music for quite a long time too and just focus on my own healing and processing things that were happening and stuff and then the last couple of months I have started to really reevaluate everything that's going on in my life and everything that I actually want in life like my own soul mission and things and the things that bring me joy I had to really reevaluate that because everything just kind of crashed and burned around me so now I feel like I'm in a rebrand kind of stage where I'm just oh, getting ready to release so much music, so much spoken word poetry, so many YouTube videos and these series and podcast episodes and so many jewellery items, so many WhatsApp messages and just motivational, inspirational thoughts. Like everything that I was doing before is coming back, but I feel like it's coming back in a brand new way where it feels a million times more authentic it feels like just more me instead of trying to chase success and trying to prove myself and trying to I don't know I guess seek external validation like so many of us do I think that is what I got caught up in for a very very long time because you know we take on these survival mechanisms as children and then when we become adults we don't realize that we're still doing them we're still running from those templates because it's just like a automatic autopilot program thing so now that I'm an adult it's time to reprogram them because I'm not a fan of lack mentality it's not fun to function from that mentality and it's been something that I've functioned from for a very long time so it's time to actually shift that and get into more of an authentic space where I can create what I want to create, I can do what I want to do, I can talk about the things that I'm passionate about and not just things that I think everybody else will love but something that I actually care about and want to talk about so that is what we're doing moving forward and it feels so good and so liberating and I'm really really excited for my music to come out because I feel like I've just elevate it to a whole new level with music production and the types of songs that I'm writing and stuff. I also calculated that there's like 50 songs on my hard drive that I want to release that I haven't even touched. <laughs> so, you know, we've just been hoarding them and storing them and it's time to actually get my life together and start releasing them. So that is what I've been lining up for you. I've been filming so much content, getting ready. I have been vlogging some of it as well. So you'll see that in Entrepreneur Life when that goes out. But yeah, there's a lot going on a lot happening and I feel like I took a massive detour of six months which honestly when I first took a few weeks off it made me want to cry because 
I like you know me if you've watched some of my vlogs I was working seven days a week I was burning myself out all the time so when I took a few weeks off I was like oh my god I'm a failure like I've basically just failed at life that's literally how I felt was that I just blew my whole music career up in the air or something because I took a few weeks off and then that few weeks turned into six months and now I actually feel pretty good about even taking that time off because it wasn't really time off although I wasn't filming or anything and I wasn't posting so much but I was doing so much inner work that just really needed to happen because otherwise I'd have just carried on burning myself out for another few years and then I'd probably got ill or something and been forced to take time off and that would have been a million times worse. So yes, we are back. There's so much coming. I'm so excited. If you have any video suggestions, definitely comment them down below because I do still want to help you and film things that you actually want advice on and care about too and it can become a conversation but there's also so many videos that I've got planned as well things that I am going through and dealing with so stay tuned for those because I am going to obviously delve deeper into um different revelations that I've had and like mental shifts and just so much emotional work as well as like practical tools on how you can do it too and yeah Oh, I'm so excited and don't forget to whatsapp me as well if you want to receive my Sunday solo trips I've decided to change them to once a week because every day was just too much like oh, it's so difficult to even post on social media every day let alone juggling all of these different social media accounts and then trying to send daily inspirational messages it was just too much so I've decided to change it to do it weekly it's going to be every Monday so then you start your week with a bit of a boost at the beginning uh, probably at like 6pm because that's when I post on social media so I'll already be on my phone and it just makes sense for me to do it then and then I will still also be sending other things throughout the week but it's just not going to be so restrictive for me like I can pick and choose when I want to do it it doesn't have to be every single day so I will actually do it and stick with it then so yes my phone number is in the description box below if you want to receive the solo trips on Sundays oh I forgot I called it Sundays. Why did I say Monday? It's going to be at the start of the week. See, I'm already forgetting things. This is why I have to write everything down. It's going to be Sundays, not Mondays. It's called Solo Trip Sundays or Sunday Solo Trips, whatever you prefer. And it's going to be 6pm on a Sunday, ready to start the week off fresh with a bit of a boost and an inspiring message. And then, yeah, throughout the week, I will also send other things and little behind the scenes and snippets of music and all kinds of things. So stay tuned for those. And is there anything else I wanted to update you on? I don't think so, but if there is, I will film it in another video because there's gonna be so many videos coming and yeah, Oh, I'm really excited. So stay tuned. Every Tuesday on my YouTube, there will be a video uploaded, but it will change of what videos I decide to upload. And there will also be a solo trip podcast on a Tuesday, but once a month, because trying to do it weekly was too much. Trying to do four videos a week was too much. I don't know how I even managed to juggle all of that and everything else that I do. Literally like a walking robot. It was so ridiculous. So once a month, there will be a podcast, but every Tuesday there will be something uploaded to YouTube. And then I will also post other things here and there whenever I'm ready and able to and have filmed exciting stuff. So I really, really appreciate you all sticking by me, especially with six month break. I got such a long time. I'm so grateful for you to still even be here riding with me. And yeah, we're in this crazy journey called life together and there's just so much coming soon and I hope you're doing well I hope you're creating the life that you love and pursuing things that bring you joy and also cutting out toxic shit relationships which I have also done so stay tuned for my relationship series because you know there is gonna be so much content I think I have written down like 10 videos or something different video ideas of what I want to film for that series of mirror mirror so please stay tuned for that one as well as consciously create with all of the um, creative tips and tricks and music things and stuff yeah there's just so many ideas so anyway I'm going to stop rambling stay tuned and I will see you in the next video I appreciate you I hope you have the best week
Take care. Bye. Oh, yeah, I think he like me. Yeah, I'm icy, cooling in that white tee. Oh, yeah, I think he like me. Yeah, I'm icy, cooling in that white tee. Oh, yeah, I think he might. I'm the thing he like in my range, all white. Oh, yeah, I think he might. I'm the thing he like in my range, all white.